Yeah, that's huge for us. We've had this one circled on the schedule as one that uh, our whole Aflac team was nervous about. You know, when we qualified well, we we weren't that fast at the beginning of the race, and Bob did a really good job dialing it in. The car and the track kind of came to us. So just uh, overall a really good night for Roush Fenway. It's, it's great to see Matt get a win. You know, those guys, uh, I guess it's great as a teammate. It's not great because now he's only seven points behind us in the chase. But um, just a, a good race, a lot better finish than I thought we were going to have. So I'm happy with it. Joining him now also is our second-place finisher in tonight's race. It's Kyle Busch. He drives the number 18 M&M's Toyota. And Kyle now moves up to fourth in points. He's 18 out of the lead. Kyle, talk about your race out here this evening. Well, it was uh, a good race for us. You know, certainly we started pretty deep in the field and made our way up through there slowly and steadily. Just uh, tough, real tough to pass and, and make up ground. You know, you could be two tenths faster than a guy in front of you. you run him down, catch him, and slow down, and you just get stuck. So... Um, you had to be creative. You had to work your way up and, um, you know, work your way past guys. But um, I don't think we made a change to the car all night. You know, we just kept running with it and uh, just kept letting it, letting the race play out and uh, let it do what it was supposed to do. And lo and behold, we thought we were going to win one. And then uh, you get down to all these late restarts and give it away. So uh, finish second. Okay, we'll take questions now. I think we've got uh, several. We'll go, to, we'll go here to Jenna, then we'll go to Viv. Jenna, then Viv. Jennifer, AP, Carl, we saw you talking to Kyle after the race, and we heard your comments on TV, um, and then Kyle shed a little bit more insight into it, and I ask this question with all due respect. Shouldn't the guys racing for second and third be racing each other hard? Because Kyle's explanation seemed to be that you were unhappy with, with the way he raced you. And Oh, yeah. Yeah, ahead. we should definitely be racing each other hard. It's just that um, – there's a difference between racing hard and then just cutting across the guy's nose. And, um, you know, what I told Kyle um, is I just wondered why coming off of turn two when I got underneath him that, uh, you know, he, he drove down instead of going up to the wall like we'd normally do. And I just let him know that next time that happens, I'll just stay where I'm at and he can drive across my hood and, and wreck himself. I mean, that's – it just surprised me. Now, he told me that uh, he didn't mean to do it. And so, you know, I, I got to believe that. And um, – I mean, I don't know what else there is to say about it. It's just it's racing, and we didn't wreck, and we're going to race hard like that. And, if, you know, that's, that's just how I saw it. 